Welcome to Ormat Academy video series. This is where we help the world enjoy green energy by design. My name is Omer and I'm with the Rotating Equipment Engineering Group in Ormat. Today we're going to talk about Ormat's turbine design and how it evolved over the years. So first, what is a turbine? A turbine is a machine that extracts energy from fluid flow and converts it into useful work. One of the most common applications of such work is turbine shaft rotation, which can be coupled to a generator shaft to produce electricity. Orma Technologies started designing and building binary turbines in the 80s. In 1992, our turbine design included the following features. 3600 RPM machine, two expansion stages, meaning two bladed wheels in the rotor, 1.8 megawatt capacity, radial split casing, which allows cost-efficient and reliable sealing of the fluid inside the turbine, and overhang the rotor design, where both bearings supporting the rotor are on the same side of the turbine wheels, outside of the process. This design was successfully installed and operated in Puna, Ormat's plant in Hawaii, not far from Kilauea Volcano. These turbine units have been in operation for over 30 years and are still spinning. By 1992, the turbine was redesigned to run at a lower speed, 1800 RPM. This machine now had larger physical dimensions and when coupled to a four-pole generator, was able to transmit a capacity of four megawatts. The new design was installed in Ormat's plant Heber in Southern California. These units have been in operation for almost 30 years now and they are still spinning. In the following years, Ormat continued to improve and hone its turbine design. By 2007, we incorporated a bigger shaft with a third bladed wheel, boosting capacity to 10 megawatts. A few years later, this turbine's design, transmissible capacity, went up to 18 megawatts. Dozens of machines of this design are spinning around the globe. However, this overhang design had its limitations. To continue to improve and advance Ormat's turbine, a new design was developed and patented, the Between Bearing Turbine. It was installed and commissioned in 2016. In this design, the turbine's rotor is supported by a bearing on each side of the wheels. This design could feature a fourth wheel and had a max capacity of 23.5 megawatts. By 2018, this design has allowed Orma to, to manufacture and install a binary turbine with multi-fluid interstage bleeding. Interstage bleeding means that some of the multi-fluid flow that goes into the turbine leaves it before passing through all of the turbine's wheels. This feature of the turbine improved the efficiency of the entire thermodynamic cycle. This design has been installed in one of Ormat's plants. Ormat's most recent between-bearing turbine design can incorporate seven stages and even potentially more if necessary. It can also incorporate an interstage injection dual pressure, meaning that in addition to the multi-fluid stream that enters through the main turbine entrance, an additional stream enters between the turbine wheels. Like the bleed turbine, this feature improves the efficiency of the entire thermodynamic cycle. With this design, a single OEC featuring two turbines coupled to a single generator can transmit a capacity of over 60 megawatts. To summarize, Ormat has a proven record of designing and operating different turbine design in various thermodynamic cycles, such as geothermal, steam bottoming units, and recovered heat. These are Ormat's main turbine models, overhang, between bearing, bleed, and dual pressure. Each model has its own advantages, allowing Ormat to offer tailor-made design, low and easy maintenance, and cost-effective products to meet the new client's demands. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.